Rakesh and welcome to my channel Hello Sahitya. Today we are going to deal with the MCQs of paper number 102 BA semester 1. We are going to deal with the MCQs of unit number 1 question number 1 chief characteristic of Elizabethan poetry. So let us start. The first question is the reigning period of Elizabethan 1 is the options are 1560 to 1603, 1580, 1558 to 1603, C 1561 to 1604, D 1564 to 1660. The right answer is D 1558 to 1603. Question number 2 How many lines does the sonnet contain? The options are A 15, B 12, C 16, D 14. The right answer is D 14. I am sorry here by mistake I have wrote, I have written 12 but the right answer is D 14. Question number 3. Who is the father of sonnet? The options are A Thomas Watt, B William Shakespeare, C Edmund Spencer, D Petrarch. The right answer is D. Petrarch. Question number four. The sonnet was first what brought to England by the options are A. Shakespeare, B. Sir Philip Sidney, C. Thomas Wright, D. Edmund Spencer. The right answer is C. Thomas Wright. Question number five. Blank was what first used by the options are William Shakespeare, B. Earl of Surrey, C. Thomas Wright, D. Edmund Spencer. The right answer is B. Earl of Surrey, who is Henry Howard. Question number 6. What is the rhyme scheme of Shakespearean sonnet? The rhyme scheme of Shakespearean sonnet is options are A, B, A, B, C, D, C, D, E, F, E, F, G, 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 B, A, B, B, A, A, B, B, A, C, D, E, C, D, E, D C A B A B B C B C C D C D E E E D none of the above. The right answer is A. The rhyme scheme of Shakespearean sonnet is A B A B C D C D E F E F G G G G. Remember that Shakespeare had Shakespeare had written 154 sonnets, and out of 154 sonnets, 126 sonnets were addressed to W H and remaining uh, sonnets were addressed to Dark Lady. The rhyme scheme A B B A A B B A C D E C D E is the rhyme scheme of Italian sonnet which is in octave and sestet and you have another sonnet that is Spencerian sonnet and the rhyme scheme of Spencerian sonnet is A B A B B C B C C D C D E E. Question number seven. What is Marlowe's mighty line? The options are A. Eric couplet. B. Free verse. C. Blank verse. D. All of the above. The right answer is C. Blank verse. Question number eight. Who made blank verse the regular meter of epic? The options are A. Shakespeare. B. Milton, C. Spencer, D. Marlowe. The right answer is B. Milton. Question number nine. Songs and sonnet is written by the options are A. Shakespeare, B. Milton, C. Spencer, D. Richard Total. The right answer is D. Richard Total. Question number 10. Since there is no help, come let us kiss and apart. Is written by the options are A. William Shakespeare, B. Milton, C. Dryton, D. Marlowe. The right answer is C. Dryton. Question number 11. The Shepherd's calendar is written by the options are A. Shakespeare, B. Milton, C. Spencer, D. Richard Total. The right answer is C. Edmund Spencer. Question number 12. The Fairy Queen was written by the options are William Shakespeare, 
B. John Milton, C. Edmund Spencer, D. Richard Total. The right answer is C. Edmund Spencer. Question number 30. The paraffin contains how many books? The options are 6, B, 12, 7, uh, C, 5, D, 3. The right answer is 6. Question number 14. The line Sweet Thames runs softly till I end my song appears in. The options are Epithelamium, B. Prothelamium, C. Periquin, D. Amoretti. The right answer is B. Prothelamium. And these lines, you can find a reference of this line in T.S. Eliot's The Wasteland. Question number 15. The title of Spencer collection of sonnet is options are A. Epithelamium, B. Prothelamium, C. Periquin, D. Amoretti. The right answer is D. Amoriti, which is a collection of 89 sonnets. Remember, it is a collection of 89 sonnets. Question number 16. The title of Sydney's book of sonnet E. The options are A. Astropal and Sahela, B. Prothelamium, C. Periquin, D. Amoriti. The right answer is A. Astropal and Stella. It is a collection of 108 songs. Uh, sonnets and 11 songs. In total there are 119 works in this collection Astrophel and Stella. Remember there are 108 sonnets and 11 songs. Question number 17. Who was soldier, sailor, explorer, courtier and writer of the Elizabethan age? The options are A. Francis Bacon, B. Sir Walter Raleigh, C. William Shakespeare, D. Spencer. The right answer is Sir Walter Raleigh. Question number 18. The longer poems Venus and Adonis and Lucrece are written by. The options are Sir Philip Sidney, B. Edmund Spencer, C. Shakespeare, D. Milton. The right answer is C. William Shakespeare. The question number 19. Euphysius is written by options are a robert green b william shakespeare c john lilly d sir philip sydney the right answer is c john lilly and that style is also known as euphysium euphysius is written by john lilly one of the university poets question number 20 sonnet is a word derived from which language the options are a britain B. American, C. Irish, D. Italian. The right answer is D. Italian and it means song. The word is derived from sonato and it means song. Okay. And you have to remember one thing is that Shakespeare's sonnet was published in year 1609 by Thomas Thorpe. Okay, I hope you have understood all the MCQs. Thank you so much.